So, welcome to what I'm going to call Update 5B for Rocket Frame 87. The project is a building and exploring simulator where you control three crash survivors on an alien world. It's a sci-fi, realistic genre game, so I'm trying to make sure that the mechanics in-game are somehow plausible in real life. And that's actually one of the biggest reasons for the next feature. I'm calling it Night Events, but it's really about people. So just as in real life, people can't work 24 hours a day, they don't respawn if they die, they can't instantaneously heal from some serious injury by taking a magic potion, and if their living conditions suck, they're going to be grumpy. Um, so they basically needed a way to quit for the evening, rest, recover, eat, and that's what the night event's about. So let's jump into it. Okay, um, I'm going to jump ahead here. Uh, in order to see all of the potential events and all of the potential features, uh, we need a little more advanced uh, village, so I'm going to jump ahead to a more advanced village. So, here we have a more built-up uh, village, and uh, it has become night. Um, so let's take a look. The idea on, the, on this side here, this uh, overnight healing, was to create a system uh, of health and healing that simulates reality without having too much micromanagement. So, basically, if one of your colonists is seriously injured, it'll take a long time to recover, just as it would in real life. If you have a skilled healer and the right supplies, you can speed things up, but it's never going to be instantaneous. So, we have one injured colonist here. We do have a healer. Um, so we're able to use this uh, this panel. Um, right now we just have some simplified medical supplies. So, um, in this case here, um, we're going to have just the first aid kit. Um, and as you decide to use this or not use this, um, you'll notice these bonuses. So essentially the healing uh, process and how much of a bonus you're going to get for it uh, will change. So you can uh, assign a first aid, first aid kit, again, yeah, just a simplified system. Complete the healing process for the evening. Um, the This side is going to be the recipe system. So there's going to be at least 25 different skills and perks available to your colonists as they gain experience. And one of the key things is that a lot of them are not going to be combat related. So one of these skills is called cook. And uh, someone who is an expert cook will be able to better make use of food supplies through this recipe system um, and uh, give a, a nutrition bonus and possibly even a morale bonus because that's what a good cook does, right? So uh, the system basically allows you to create recipes um, by mixing different ingredients and by choosing the right quantity of ingredients. And again, we have the process here. Um, by choosing them in the right order and the right quantity, you can start getting a bonus. So here we don't have much of a bonus because it's just too small. Um, but as you increase it, you start seeing here, a bonus starts to pop up. As we keep increasing, um, then eventually the bonus will increase. So the last category here is this uh, happiness. Um, and again, that's also going to depend on the skill of the cook. So here, once we're going to start spicing things up, adding some herbs and spices, um, then you can start having this uh, happy, happiness bonus come up. So once you're done with that, then you can cook the evening meal. It gets pushed out to everybody, um, and you're left with the, the usual uh, message and so forth. Good. Um, so that's it for night events. The, uh, the long delay, well, I did have a little bit of a snag. Uh, it was the algorithm that I was using for navigation and AI. Uh, so I had mentioned earlier there's not a lot of creatures running around. I did have that set up, uh, and it worked okay when I had one or two alien creatures running the landscape. But uh, once I had a whole bunch of them, adding in spawn points and having dozens of them running around, it didn't work so well. So. Um, I uh, have been spending a lot of time trying to redo a, a new system for AI and navigation, um, and it's turning out to be a little more involved than I thought. Um, but uh, hopefully we'll get going again on that, and we'll be able to show you some new stuff. So thanks so much for watching.